how to find mass, material, and volume in Onshape. Uh, I'll warn you, I went looking for this and it took me a, a fair amount of time to find it. And that's not unusual, this is why you want to work with other people whenever possible, because it'll just save time. Uh, it's good to be independent and I'll show you can do it yourself, but even better if there's a skilled professional nearby who you don't mind asking a few questions. Um, anyway, first things first, if we want mass, we have to give it a property. I've already given this one a property. Uh, you, you right click on it, by the way, I already built this. I built it wrong, just went back and fixed it. How do you fix it? Well, I went over here and I double clicked on sketch. And then this was 1.5, hey, I can't see it. This was 1, so I fixed it to 1.5 and hit this and everything updated. So I felt silly, but uh, it's all good. So right click on it and somewhere it's going to say assign material. All right. Now, I actually just screwed up. I only picked the top, so don't do that. Drag over all of it. Now it highlights everything. Assign material for part one. Now I picked 300 series uh, stainless steel. I'm actually going to pick something slightly different. Um, I'm just going to go with straight stainless steel. I'll go to the first one that I get to on the way down. It doesn't really matter. The steel is going to be close. Your mass doesn't have to be perfect, but your volume should be. So it took a while, and it said, hey, if you want any dimensions, just click on what you want, and it shows up in the bottom right. Hey, there's the area of the front. But it doesn't do that for the whole thing. You need to be in assembly, and notice at the bottom, it automatically generate, generated an assembly file. So let's go there. It, it's not here. Yeah, that's fine. Insert uh, part one. Nice that they made it easy on me. Click check piece of cake and then drag over everything and it gives you a little scale looking device you click it and there's everything you need surface area should be 50.625 your volume should be 16.531 your mass should be about 4.8 pounds I went and looked at the one in Autodesk Inventor and it's close but not quite the same so that's it good luck